morning everyone welcome back to vlogmas day 10 i'm sorry for like the past three videos and for the tomorrow's video i'm gonna be sitting in the same spot but it's just easier when i'm using my laptop so that's a little disclaimer but today is super exciting because we are going to be tier ranking book boyfriends okay i am so excited for this i actually used the romance book boyfriend tier list i will link it down in the description if you want to rank the boys for yourself but i'm super excited because it looks like we have um a till death do us part put me in potential not my type bland by and then author needs therapy i think for some of the guys that i have no idea who they are i'm just going to not put them in that way they're just void i wish there was one that was like i don't know these people but there isn't unless without further ado let's just get into it because i'm super excited to do this okay the first person we have is crew lancaster no idea who that is if you guys um if any of these book boyfriends are like i need to know who they are let me know what guy correlates to what book and i will read it 100 percent because i always love having new book boyfriends you know it's always like it's like collecting maybe that's bad okay so i'm just gonna throw him at the end the first two we have and i'm categorizing them together is conrad and jeremiah fisher the brothers you know from the summer i turned pretty for me personally i was rooting for jeremiah i don't know why but there was something about conrad just showing it was almost like embarrassing to belly because he sure he liked her but the way he was treating her i was just like girl you have a guy here jeremiah who is obsessed with you who loves you and you love him too like it works but then of course the second book happened and then the third book happened and i didn't like jeremiah anymore so personally for me they are both bland i'm gonna put them there i don't uh i might i might come back to that just just saying okay I have ledger and i'm pretty sure ledger is from reminders of him at least i'm pretty sure i'm gonna say it is um if it's not correct me please but i'm pretty sure ledger is from reminders of him which he bought like all this stuff to make sure she had her coffee at his bar and i'm just like put me in i'm gonna think i'm gonna i Ugh, I might move him down to potential, but we just kind of have to see how it goes. But right now, I'm saying put him in is where I have him. Connor Cobalt. Yeah, till death do with this part. Do I even need to explain? Cobalt is from the Callaway um, Addicted to You series. Um, he is Rose's partner, this, like, the first book of the Callaway spinoff series, and Reich is Daisy's, um, partner, and he is, like, also, like, I'm super obsessed with him, but for some reason, he is not till death do his part, like, I'm pretty sure he would be a step below Connor Cobalt for me personally, so I'm gonna put him down there, okay? Um, Declan Kane, I feel like I've heard that name, but don't know who that is, so we're moving on to Miles Archer. Now, this is Ugly's Love, main character, and I know it's bad, but Ugly Love, I would argue, is one of my, one of my favorites. Like, I want to say it's my favorite Colleen Hoover book. I don't know why, but that book just, there's something about it that I just love so much, and I would eat him up. Like, I personally would love Miles Archer, but I'm like, I'm, the fact that I'm hesitating, the fact that I'm hesitating, I don't want to put him into death to uh till death do his part and i'm a little scared to put him and put me in because i feel like i'm gonna get a lot of hate for it when like he should be an author needs therapy because that's where he's that's where he's at but i'm like is author needs therapy like me like even though he may need therapy and the author also needs therapy for even making a character that looks like this um that doesn't mean i wouldn't still date him so i'm gonna put him and put me in okay sorry i, I can't help myself okay okay Thoyer and Pike. Again, don't know who those people are, okay? I'm sorry. Adam Carlson? Guys, I feel like I'm the most basic girl ever. I'm putting him in Put Me In. I'm sorry. I was obsessed with him. Allie Hazelwood does a fantastic job at writing her men. They're just all obsessed with the women, and that's what I want. And so... Wait. Fox is from Hook, Line, and Sinker, right? Okay pretty sure Fox is from Hook, Line, and Sneaker, and literally, I just, like, forgot who he is, so I'm putting him in potential. I'm sorry. I did really enjoy that book, but he has to go there. Alex, though, don't know who that is. Matthias Helver, I'm pretty sure, is from the Six of Crows duology. I just read that in November, and honestly, I'm gonna say not my type. 
he just not my type i think he was really sweet i like him with nina but like not for me kaz on the other hand i'm putting him and put me in because we didn't even get to see a romantic side like he needs to go in therapy he and miles both need to go to therapy together with their collective art authors but kaz something about him something about him but the thing is is like i would never like i could never be an edge like we wouldn't work out okay i'm all your perfects which is another colin hoover novel i really like this one i rated it five stars um well actually that book was confusing because i felt it was like the first colin hoover book where it had no relatability or sympathy for either of the characters and so like he was i did like him he did some shady things as well as she did like they both were not perfect characters um but he like fought for his his wife and i'm just gonna put him in potential this corrigan okay my first instinct was like to do till death do us part but i'm like is that because i really like am obsessed with him or is that because everybody else is and then i thought about it for a second and i was like yeah i should just put him and put me in because oh there's two of him okay we're putting both of them there or maybe i should just throw it out there's like the only one until death do us part yikes okay next we have elliot petropoulos i've heard of this person cannot remember can't remember i'm sorry or i don't know who he is then we have dean holder and i know this is from the off campus series cannot remember which one i'm pretty sure it was the second one no not the second one the third one because he got with the with hannah's best friend and honestly i think i'm just gonna say like not my type because or maybe it, i'm gonna say potential potential for dean holder because no actually no not my type um him and her really good not for me i did really like enjoy i did really enjoy like reading him and liked him as a character but like overall nah be who that is same with owen jameson and grayson i know who those people are have not read the inheritance game so if you guys think i should read it motivate me please okay then we have archer hale putting my boy archer anywhere other than the very very top you're wrong he is the ultimate book boyfriend i'm not even kidding look we're gonna pull up my phone and i'm gonna show you what i decided to start reading yesterday because i just needed to read something about look right there reading so good it's so freaking good i love archer if you haven't read archer's voice read it please it's it'll change your life okay alex and it says pwmov people we meet on vacation oh okay he's going in potential because like people we meet on vacation was my least favorite he was my least favorite guy character but like i would still date him you know then here's the thing here's the thing about this is because if this was like a ya thing maxim would probably be in like the top two but since this he, this is like just a romance book boyfriends i'm seeing i'm thinking maxim is just like bland by although i really loved him like i loved him in america loved his character i thought he was adorable the break break my heart a thousand times it was only ever yours to break anyways like that quote really gets me but he just has to go there because it just makes sense I don't know who that is kenji from shatter me kenji is going put me in i really like kenji okay rowan kane why do i not know who any of these people are okay sam every summer after we're gonna put him potential potential okay cassian put me in azriel put me in aaron blackford potential aaron warner till that do this part immediately immediately Sorry. Sorry, I am flying through this. Elastra, put me in. Wit, Summer Broken Rules. I'm just like, I'm gonna say not my type because that I don't really remember anything like too much about him, but I'm sure he was great. Whereas Garrett Graham was from The Deal and I'm doing put me in for him. Gus Everett, personally for me, Beach Read was my favorite. He is a till death do us part. He's my favorite book boyfriend out of all of them. I'm sorry, I know Charlie's like amazing, but something about Gus just got me, okay? Augustus, tell me that name doesn't just, it's amazing. Reese, 
Reese, I gotta say, put me in again, also. Lauren Hale, death to us part. Lauren Hale, I'm a Lilo fan so much. Lauren Hale is my favorite from the Addicted to You and Callaway Sister series. Read that book and especially read him and Lily's stories. It just, it's so good. I love it so freaking much, okay? Nathan, honestly, I'm just gonna say Bland, bye. Like he was cute, it was cute, but Bland. Lucian, I am doing Put Me In because honestly, anybody in, anybody in the Akatar series, like all of them are hot. All of them need therapy, but all of them are hot and I would do it, okay? Game. Um, bland bye sorry i used to be obsessed with him but genuinely he is bland okay it's it's a common knowledge at this point all the rest of the people i have already done or i don't know who they are so i feel like i have to leave it there so yeah that was the end of this video i think we should conclude from this video that the fact that i would date any of these men i would marry any of them they're all fantastic i'm sure even the ones that i don't know who i wasn't able to rank i would marry okay you guys so much for watching this video sorry it was a quick one let me know if you guys have a another tier ranking you want to see in the future this was a lot of fun tier rankings are always fun to do and watch so yeah i will talk to you guys tomorrow in the second to last vlogmas i think yeah second to last vlogmas is tomorrow which is crazy but yeah i will talk to you guys very soon peace and love bye guys